My name is Tom, and I'm 85 years old, and I've been living here uh, for 42 years. I used to go to the Legion there for evenings. And, yeah, I'm trying to think all the things I used to do. I know I was quite busy all the time. I was never bored. I went into the hospital because my lung had collapsed. Then I got home, it took me a while to adjust to the breathing and I started with the oxygen. And life started to get a little bit boring and a little more lonely. I guess I watched more television. Slept a lot because there's nothing else to do when you couldn't get around, so. The Senior Services Society that were providing Meals on Wheels for me, they found that I was staying home a lot. And I had a motor scooter that was sitting in my hallway for about two years without being used. And then they said, well, would you use it if you had somebody accompany you? I said, oh, yeah. So that's where Ken came into the picture. On our first day that we've met, we went out for a ride on the scooter. It was his first time out in probably about a year and a half. Yeah, well, once we got our scooter through the elevator and downstairs and out the door and what have you, I got the feel of it, so he would be walking behind. Walk, so I, 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 I was so jogging behind that. I was speeded up and make her run. <laughs> <laughs> but it was fun because every time he got his breath back again, I'd speed up and <laughs> play him out again. <laughs> I decided to become a volunteer because my mom is a volunteer coordinator and uh, she talks about the good feelings that other people get and as far as the, the people on the receiving and the giving and that kind of made me feel like I wanted to be a part of that. Tom's got a great list of stories here. He's got lots of words of wisdom as well to throw in there. He's pretty young, so I can't go on and lead him astray. <laughs> He's getting a kick out of this. I'm thinking ahead of all the possibilities and things that we can do. He's single, and I'm single, so we got lots to do. Once I get my pilot's license, one of the first things on the list would be to, to get Tom in the air. A little more active now, I think things are starting to come back together again. So I'm being well looked after anyway. <laughs> Thank you, United Way donors. I really appreciate it.